Greetings to all of my friends today. It's great to be able to come to you today on this broadcast. Thank you for tuning in today. We praise the Lord today because He is good, and this is the day that the Lord has made. I want to talk to you on the 12th chapter of Genesis, and I want to talk to you about Egypt when they were Israelites were in Egypt. They were having some very difficult times. And they prayed unto God to deliver them from Pharaoh. There were many plagues. There were like ten plagues that happened there, but he still wouldn't let the people of Israel go. He kept hanging on. So finally one day the Lord said, um, I want you to kill a lamb, and I want you to drain the blood, and I want you to put it up on the doorpost, two doorposts of your door. And all the firstborn in, in Egypt are gonna be uh, are gonna be dead. But if you'll put the blood on that, it's, it's going to protect your household when I come by and, and, uh, and, and destroy all of those because Pharaoh won't let you go. So finally, after a lot of press process, uh, you know, the blood applied on the doorpost reminds me of Calvary. You know, the greatest, you know, that was repulsive to be able to, to drain the blood to kill like they used to have to kill and offer sacrifice. You know, sin is repulsive to God. God does not like sin. And this great ultimate sacrifice, of course, came when Jesus died on the cross of Calvary. This very day was a Passover when they were to leave. It's a day of deliverance and victory for the children of Israel because they commanded, the Lord said, you're to roast, roast this lamb and to eat it all or destroy it all before the next morning, and I'm going to let you go. And also with bitter herbs, you know, uh, you can enjoy your meal. So God gave them great, great victory and deliverance from Pharaoh. And you know, the story goes on as it goes on a little bit further that Pharaoh followed them all the way to the Red Sea. And you know, they I'm sure Israel became afraid and said, yeah, have we got from Israel to be, I mean, from Egypt, if we got to this place to where we are going to be destroyed, but God gave them a great victory. Now, I want to tell you, there was a lot of people involved in marching out of there. It, it's it been estimated there was five to three million people that left Egypt to go to the promised land, and they started toward the promised land. God is a great deliverer. And this was a Passover. We're to remember Jesus on this Friday because that started the Passover. And we know that Jesus died on the Passover. Thank you so much, Lord, for doing this for us. And thank you for tuning in today. And I'll talk to you again real soon.